welcome to Fashion Sewing Blog TV. I'm Colleen G. Lee and in this video tutorial I'm going to show you how to do a cover stitch using your sewing machine. Here is an example of a cover stitch done on a professional uh, cover stitch machine. You'll find them on sportswear and dancewear uh, garments and what you have is two parallel lines of stitching done with a twin needle and to the wrong side you'll have this overlock serge stitch. Now this is what I'm going to be doing on my sewing machine. The first thing you need to do is turn up your hemline to your desired length. I'll just open that out. So I've got some stretch fusible interfacing here and we need that in order to keep the shape of the stitching. So I've done it just half of the example I've got here so you can see the difference without the um, stabiliser at the back of the garment. So we're going to take it to the sewing machine and we're going to start sewing. Now this is a tricky part when coming to do a cover stitch on a sewing machine because you have to sew on the right side of the garment so you can't see your hemline at all. So a good practice is to put a tape on the side of your machine like so. I hope you can see that I've done some pencil marks in there so that you can see that I'm placing it against the edge of the tape so that I've got that equal distance of sewing all the way around so it gives me greater accuracy. So place it right there, make sure it's against my tape, place the needle down, like a stitch. And then from now on it's just a case of doing your straight stitching, you don't have to worry too much, just make sure that you're using your tape as a guide to keep your stitching in line and just do straight sewing. Here's the cover stitch with the stabiliser and it's nice and flat. On the opposite side where there's no stabiliser there's a rippling effect. And this is what it looks like on the wrong side you've got that zigzag effect. A cover stitch is great to use on knit type fabrics but it can be also used on woven fabrics. You can buy special needles that are for knits and also for woven. So why not give it a try? Don't forget to subscribe to Fashion Zone Blog TV for free weekly video tutorials and if you have any comments or queries please put me in the comment box below and I will see you next time.